Hello everyone, welcome to this tutorial search in text part 3. The text is to complete the search application from previous tasks. In addition to the requirements of task uh, previous, the task must also meet these requirements. The user must be able to edit and save the loaded text. Implement a single linked list that uh, represents the history of reading by text file and each node in the list must contain at least the name of the text file the total number of characters in the file as well as the date and time of loading if the same text file is loaded twice the previous node must be removed a tree control should be on the program panel that shows the file history tree controls should only display the five most recently opened files. We have uh, one uh, text and uh, it has 319 text um, sign and the last, uh, the last uh, three ten is uh, in this datum in this time and another text is up here also and the same and so on okay we are going to start a program user template and it appear a panel the window panel you are going to right click on it menu bar and you put uh, you are going to um, you are going to uh, its uh, control and the file has opened save close and the window is closed and then uh, you have a text box here and you have another list list box it must be list box it is a tree um, Okay, I call this uh, list box as tree. List box tree. Tree is here. List and tables tree. The mid the middle one. And you are going to uh, edit. And here you are going to have a files, and then add item or add child or edit items it's enough that you are going to have a one and the rest of them is uh, uh, standard and the label is file control okay and you need a quit button then you are going under code generate main function or callbacks panel callback and then uh, you are uh, it uh, uh, creates uh, the C file and you must put uh, this uh, this uh, header file and the uh, uh, static int panel handle and you add m p n q l and the uh, file name uh, max path name length time buffer is 100 date 100 size 50 character name is uh, max length and uh, a pointer character name one and two file uh, EFP and OFP and then uh, you have a dim menu item count char search entry find time date look entry the main value must be here you can pause the video and copy all those uh, codes and all of them are global variable and then a quit callback you put uh, this function and in dim menu item if k get panel menu bar panel handle set menu bar attribute uh, menu file open attribute dimmed zero then uh, you put save and it's dim and end and the uh, menu bar 
file close attribute dimmed n and n is here is 1 and then uh, attribute k in uh, windows uh, close and attribute dim n so now in open callback you need a array of a string of 80 characters and pointed character name 2 and integer j equals 0 file select pop up x you are going to open the file load button and file, put it in file name m equals open file file name read only open as is and well ascii and efp is file open file name for read only and while f get us everything 80 characters from uh, input file you put it in uh, character string is not null you are going to set the text box string and new line you are going to close the file and s print f name with the string file name file name in name name to string took name with the double slash because it's going to read the whole um, the whole um, uh, file from the root until the uh, uh, top and the while name to string to this one is not null name one equal name two and minus minus n and the menu items empty we are going to call this one it is already a and we are going to find the size and find the time uh, with those uh, uh, functions and then uh, we are going to sprint f size size ei and date date modified time buffer which we have read it from all those uh, three functions if p not equal zero j looking three if j equal zero set active three item panel panel three zero will add item to selection insert three item as sub uh, siblings and uh, use it these keywords those uh, uh, codes and again you are going to have a child and the uh, wall first with size name one uh, and p plus one and another child p plus one wall last date name and null p plus two and you are going to increment p v3 and increment q if q is six you are going to use delete list item you are going to put away the first uh, the first uh, node in the tree uh, to get a, a place for the fifth one and we are going to put q uh, decrement q and decrement p then is save callback we uh, are going to have use array of characters and uh, integers and we are going to uh, open output file as w and then we are going to get num text box line text box line and you are going to put it in the line and then if i less than lines you are going to use get text box line 
and we are going to use those variables i and s and uh, then uh, f print f uh, output file s you are going to put s to uh, output file then in close we are going to use close file m and reset te uh, text box we clear and we are going to increment n and we are going to call dim menu items dim menu items was uh, here dim menu item we are going to put uh, those uh, things and then um, in w window close callback we are going to close the file and reset text box and increment n and we are going to call the dim menu item function and in int char count ch character int k equals one and efp efp full pen file name for read while f get c character of from uh, input file is not end of file we are going to uh, increment k and return k and uh, find time date uh, double now second int hour minute day month day year get current date time put it in now format date time string now with uh, this format and this format and you, we are going to use time buffer we have read before and with 100 uh, uh, ele uh, characters get date time elements now over minute second indicated this month day year indicated this and s print f time buffer we have here with uh, those with uh, two digits only and uh, integers okay look in tree if i0 l l and h0 character buffer max path lane for something while i less than p and uh, we are going to get three item panel handle panel three with val sibling i val first val next val expand in address l get three item tag we are going to in panel three i plus one and buffer and if string compare name one and buffer is zero it is the same h equals one replace item in tree with i plus one name one i plus one replace list item again with i plus two size i plus two and then i plus three date i plus three and we are going to increment i v3 okay we are going i hope that you have paused each uh, each time i was uh, describing you have paused and uh, copy the uh, source code we are running now oh it cannot replace it in uh, in the hard disk because it is in external hard disk it is hard disk okay but everything works i promise you and uh, see you on next tutorial thank you for watching